Barnsdale Junior Art Center and Sarah what do you do here at, at Barnsdale? I am our program education coordinator so I designed the program for the juniors so I decide what class is gonna be most benefit for the kids and for the parents in the community and I also teach the classes. What, what class do you teach? I teach our classes so for teenager painting class and fashion illustration at this moment. Woohoo! Yay! Yay! Fashion illustration, nice. Yeah. All righty. Well, thank you. Center, we do have uh, our classes from toddler all the way to high school students, and you could find us at uh, barnstall.org. Each time, whenever we have a new session start, you will see all the classes schedule with the teaching artist name and class description, and the time and the price and everything you could find about us. <laughs> Hashtag BFF best friend forever and all the art class teaching artists uh, helped me to create an art piece about best friend and Kamaya's art class come up with amazing idea about teaching the kids a sign language the kids choose a vocabulary about best friends about friendship and that each kids make the clay work of, of, of their vocabulary with the sign languages and another amazing thing was uh, Kamaya come up with the idea and putting the braille under that. And which was crazy because now in public art display in LA, the city require all the public art show needs to have a braille for the people who needs it. So in Kamaya, of course, she didn't know about it. And when we present the idea to the director. He was really excited because uh, we were ahead of what the city actually doing it and he was really surprised. This is actually behind the scene. Actually, the policy is changing right now. And then now in the October, we are having the first show that has actual prayer for everything. All the city of LA, our show has to have a prayer. Yeah, I thought we Yeah, I Oh, the one Very fun. How you say? Hello. Yeah. 
as an entrepreneur? That's really, really important question. And I'm even learning right now how can I unlock the cre creativity in daily life. I think the most key is break the fear of making mistake. And art, you have to honor the process of making art. It's not about the the result, what you're, what you're getting it at the end, you really have to enjoy the process of allow yourself, give yourself permission to make mistake, give yourself a, a permission to explore all different direction. If you don't break that fear, you will got, you will get locked in in a certain style. So I'm challenging myself to break the fear and then give myself to a permission to make a mistake. And, and trying to find fun where I'm doing that. That's so children's book all the way to some painting that I recently did and I'm doing the a painting series of, about lighting so you will find more about that at odreamfactory.com. My major uh, medium is acrylic painting but I do a lot of collage in a very subtle way and I like the quality of hidden so when the audience pay attention more there's more story behind it so I like to use collage but not in obvious way but my major medium is acrylic painting because I could play so many different ways. So today's my last day at Barnstall and I just want to honor Sarah and thank her for getting me up here on the hill at Barnstall Yay! Junior Arts Center and giving me a chance to work with kids in clay and teaching them um, what, how fun it is to roll and play in the mud. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Sarah. No problem, thank you for coming here. <laughs> Thank you.